favourite verses in the Bible is John 15, 15. It says, I no longer call you servants because a servant does not know his master's business. Instead, I've called you friends for everything that I learned from my father, I've made known to you. This verse tells us that Jesus is our friend. Can you imagine Jesus, God, the King of Kings being your friend? Wow! But what does friendship with Jesus mean? The reason that Jesus gave in the verse for calling us friends is, everything that I've learned from the Father, I've made known to you. This implies that Jesus is willing to share everything He knows with us. There are no secrets between Him and us. Therefore, being friends with God means we can enjoy a transparent and intimate relationship with Him. This very idea is exemplified in Abraham's relationship with God. He is described as a friend of God on three occasions in the Bible. God would often appear to Abraham and have long chats with him. In the presence of this Almighty God, Abraham would share without reservations. He was free to be himself. One time, Abraham even expressed his displeasure at God for God's seeming delay in giving him a child. When Abraham was 99, God assured him that the promised child would be born to him in the following year. Do you know how Abraham responded to this? He laughed. When God wanted to destroy Sodom and Gomorrah, he paused and asked himself, Shall I hide from Abraham what I am about to do? When you look at all these instances, you can see that both God and Abraham were transparent and intimate with each other. They shared from their hearts and there were no secrets between them. Brothers and sisters, it was God treating me as a friend that saved me from a possible mental breakdown in my teenage years. I was so, so lonely during those times as my parents were hardly at home and my other siblings were away for their tertiary education. I resorted to talking to myself in the mirror for extended periods at a time. I was told that if I continued to do so, I might have a mental breakdown. I was afraid. I was very anxious. Immediately, I turned to God in prayer and He assured me that He will be my friend. He said I could talk to Him and tell Him anything I wanted to. From then on, I often invited Jesus to sit in front of me and I enjoyed long, transparent and intimate chats with Him. As a result, I stopped feeling lonely and did not suffer any mental breakdown. Instead, I grew in my relationship with God. Brothers and sisters, Jesus wants to be your friend. He loves you and wants to have an open and intimate relationship with you. Do not be afraid to come and share your heart with Him. He's always available to listen to you. God bless you.